the topic is uh, because I need to use computational thinking to try to teach um, programming methodology in my university. Well, it's important because um, the application of computational thinking is directed towards the discipline, so science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Uh, this represents a um, um, focus in the educational innovation uh, because if uh, try to use in another context, it could be a surprise because I need to teach computational thinking before uh, in, the early, in, in an early age. Well, it's important to me because this kind of uh, skills can be learning using um, game model to avoid being frustrating and demanding activity by the students. Uh, but don't forget it that computational thinking is not a synonym for programming. So it comes very important, don't forget it. Well, in my university, I am from Puebla, Mexico, in the last 13 years, 13 years, uh, all the course is in presential. No use of another kind of technology or tools of technology. Uh, and if I consider factors such as the session, high and variable rates of fails, and the loss of academic performance, well, it's a problem where I need to resolve. So I try to use other ways to teach the program com program methodology. Um, well, the principal idea is try to redesign the programming methodology course uh, because each thematic unit is greatly based on cognitive category of taxonomy. And um, previous work used a relationship between these concepts. So I use this is theoretical project and try to use it in my university. Well, the initial proposal of computational thinking involves the concept of solving problems, um, the design system, and the human, uh, understand the human behavior. Yes, I know that, but what are the, <coughs> the direction with computer science? Well, with the pass of the time, the concept of solving problems continue to be part of the concept, uh, has with the relation with computer science. So this is a good point to try to uh, find a relation with my problem in my university. Well, we propose this relation using the, the content of the thematic units. I say, well, the thematic unit one name base corresponds to the skills to abstraction and the composition. In taxonomy rooms, this corresponds to the level analysis. And a second thematic unit title expressions, well, it's possible to correspond to the skill generalization because correspond to the level application. And the thematic unit three corresponds to topics, uh, algorithms, and flow charts. Well, it's, it's very easy to confuse the cost of corresponds to the skill algorithmic designs and evaluation, and this corresponds to the Bloom's taxonomy. It's a proposal to use a uh, this uh, relationship. I uh, not try to reinvent the, the wheel. So use um, regions the another uh, the another source, recognized source and international level. Uh, I use the UT Vibras, I use the computer Olympian search. For example, I use the the region called model the evaluate the ability of the composition. You know, you have this picture and the relationship with this, uh, with an expression of number on parentheses corresponds to a mobile, is a small mobile composition, right? Uh, the students, when, when I see this, well, this is try to evaluate the abstraction because as the student shows, analyzes, and determine what information is uh, attempting to resolve the problem. Uh, this exercise taken uh, from Vibras 2 evaluate the generalization corresponds to the topic. Well, when the students resolve it or analyze this problem with six spies, well, it's, it's can use this kind of information because he have a similar situation in this case with five spies. 
the person that wrote uh, bullet jumping came from the computer Olympiad. Uh, algorithm design is this exercise. Well, you know the beavers need to cross the holes uh, because he follows some kind of instructions. It's a good example to evaluate the algorithm design. And finally, uh, bullet jumping, if the students follow the instructions, well, then he can find the right solution. Well, I use these five regions to test or to measure the computational thinking and then offer to the students options on uh, how to study the material of the uh, uh, programming methodology. Um, it's important to think and options to the students. For example, if you have the right uh, answers uh, of the regions, you can take the <coughs> course online, um, the evaluations too, and 50 days after, give me um, the evidence of the course. If the students present um, good evidence, it's possible that the students accredit the course because he has the ability. But in the other side, if the students got five wrong um, answers, well, it's possible the student need the classroom because he's like, like the bus. He needs the professor in the classroom, teach the bus team, you know. Um, I do different scenarios, for example, semi distance, but I change the time. Always watching what, what is the wrong exercise that you evaluated before? Well, I make an um, experiment before to use this from the students. I get uh, 18 voluntary students from the three quarter, and they ask, uh, they ask, answer me which knowledge are already familiar from the first course. Um, it's me. They tell me if you know type data variables, algorithm operators, this content, and then they perform the evaluation of computational thinking, and I try to verify the correspondence between the results, and it takes six days. For example, the student claim to know all the knowledge and got the correct answer. It's an ideal. Uh, um, Results, but I have two contradictory results because he say me she know all the knowledge but in correct responses uh, result in the problem. When the thematic unit present different level of knowledge, the student have, for example, in the case C, some knowledge I'm not and I got uh, correct answers. Uh, for example, I'm in familiar, but I got reactive to, for two skills. This is a correct correlation because the student represents a real knowledge. <coughs> well, I think uh, we have a justified proposal to say how to relation the knowledge and the content of the course. For me, it's important. Uh, use the evaluation of computational thinking because I have a possibility to say to students, now you can study the course in this way. Um, obviously I use my experience to create the option to the students. Uh, during, the, during the period of September to December 2016, I using this proposal with two experimental groups. I, I want to compare the numbers of predicted students, the sessions, and the academic level exit. I'm using the platform module. It, to, to all this will represent the future work. Thank you for your attention.